It is time to work on day seven of the January Doodle Days challenge from Poet Spice. I am really having fun doing these doodle sketch faces off of vintage photos. Just so fun. I can hardly believe I'm on day seven, which means a whole, an entire week. It's going fast. And I'm also trying to decide what sketch to do. I love this photo. He just, this gentleman looks like he means business, doesn't he? And then here she is behind him supporting him. I really like this. I love the sepia in this. And I love how it kind of, but this is obviously an older photo, so it's faded out. But I love how it fades out into the background. And it's either between this one and here again, both of these photos are older photos and they've faded out and they've taken on this yellow, yellowish sepia tone. And I really like this one, but look at how, look how long his neck is. I mean, he's got a very, very long neck. And I was trying to figure out where his... It's hard to see where the shirt begins and the neck ends here. I can't, because you can see the bow tie right here, and you're wanting to draw that. Your eye is wanting to follow the, the collar there, but maybe it goes up further. But at any rate, he's got a very long neck, and it appears even longer because the top of his head is faded out. So you might guess that the top of his head, let me get a pencil. You might guess that the top of his head might fall right in here. But I like this one because if I sketch it, I can concentrate on the eyes and the ear and maybe this side of his face. So I do think I'll work on this one and then maybe the next one I will do will be this. I, I want to do them... I'll probably skip a page. I want to do her and him on facing pages. But I'm going to work on this fellow next, I believe. So that's what I'm going to work on today for day seven. I'm going to go into fast forward and you can watch.
something a bit different when I show the end pictures. A review of what I think about the final result. First, things I like about this doodle sketch face, that's what I've taken to calling these now, is, well, again, I think I achieved a nice sketchy doodle. I like the expression in the eyes. I think that I achieved what I wanted with the white hair over the left ear. And I think I captured the man's big neck. I like the arch of the eyebrows, and I think I achieved a little of the way that the head blended into the background because of how the photo fades. I'm even not totally unhappy with the nose. Now, holding the inspiration photo up again, he hardly looks like the photo. Not that that really bothers me. This is just a really quick doodle sketch after all, not a photorealistic rendering. But I would change a lot if I doodle sketched this face again. I want more of a yellow ochre tone and less gray. The mouth could be much smaller and the eyes could be smaller. The size of the drawing really does make a difference. My doodle sketch has a larger, more distinct features. I would definitely make the mouth smaller and the eyes smaller. And even though I like the impression of that shock of white hair on the top right of his head, it's probably not that long on the inspiration photo and could blend into the background a whole lot more. But all in all, this really was a fun doodle sketch and I'm really not unhappy with the result.